everyone welcome back to my channel if you are new and even bigger welcome i'm not gonna say how are we all how are we all doing because i say that every single opening of my vlog and i'm actually sick to death of me saying the same thing every time i open and close a vlog I mean, oh my god, I'm surprised I have any subscribers at this point because I get on my own goddamn nerves. I look like I have just rolled in dirt because, guilty, I have just fake tanned and I have just been away for the weekend <laughs> to Spain where it was really warm, but I just really fancied like, I, I'm just having a fake tan day because I've got an event tomorrow, I've got loads of things on this week and I've, and I've got a shoot on Thursday, so I'm like, I, I just... You know, life is better tanned, and you girly pops can probably all vouch for that. I have so much to catch you guys up on. I have finally, guys, you're going to be so proud of me. I have finally created, like, a backlog of videos that I'm posting weekly. So, my Instagram, not my Instagram, my YouTube is going to be popping off the next few weeks. Because I've got videos upon videos upon videos, and I'm not going to stop. I'm going to keep going. Where I have, and this is what kind of what I wanted to do this year, um, obviously Made in Chelsea, I haven't been filming as much, and that is not because, like, I do actually adore the show, and I, and I wasn't going to do it last, this series, but you guys kind of prompted me to still do it, so I've kind of, like, dipped in and out, which is what I wanted to do, because, and the main reason for that is, I have so many great things going on at the moment that I just... Filming takes up so much of my time, so I wanted a little break from it, just so I could like concentrate and finally get going properly with my YouTube as a main one, my Instagram content, my Bikini Bible stuff, some other really, really fun, exciting new projects coming up, which I'm so excited to share with you, but I can't yet because, well, I'm close to signing the papers. But we're not we're not there yet, we're not yet. But it's gonna be amazing when it does happen. So yes, I'm very, very excited. Not sure if you guys can have any guesses, but um yeah, it's gonna be great. I am super excited for the next few months. I'm gonna I can't wait to take you guys along with me. I've got so many fun things planned. I've got trips, I've got loads of work stuff. I'm just I'm very, very busy. And I like being busy. I'm one of those people, I don't know if you guys, I don't know if you girls watching this are similar to me. I have to be busy. If I'm not constantly busy, I just spiral. I just, like, my mind is crazy. I'm one of those people who, I, I, I actually can't sit still. I, even in my flat, like, even on a day off, not that I have a really a day off, apart from even on the weekends, you don't find, I, I literally can't sit in front, of, I cannot sit on the sofa unless I'm, like, napping when I'm really hungover, but I can't sit the I can't sit down. If I even if I'm like on a day off, I'll still just start cleaning the house or like I'll just stop doing something or like go on my laptop or like be ordering things. So yeah, anyway, I feel like this is a really long rambling intro and I do look like I I look dirty. I am gonna go shower this off. It's only been on for a few hours, so I'm gonna go shower off now. So do excuse the absolute state of me. I look a complete mess. I haven't been out of this house no word of a lie apart from for a walk for two days because I've been sat at my laptop working which is always fun but you know we got to make the dollar so this is why we hustle on a another note now I am showered and my tan is looking 90% real I have just had my hello fresh delivery this video is kindly sponsored by HelloFresh, but I do genuinely, genuinely love this brand. It makes my life so much easier having HelloFresh in it. Honestly, during the week, I get very bored. I don't know about you guys, but I do get very bored of cooking the same things. I absolutely love home-cooked food, as you guys well know. Through all my videos, I'm always home cooking. And I get bored, I cook the same things. So HelloFresh for me, just not only saves me from going food shopping, but also allows me to get new recipes and new ideas. And I love it. They come with these amazing recipe cards, which I then keep and reuse them. So I now have a lovely little stack of all different recipes, which 
after a few times of kind of doing them, you then slowly start to naturally remember how to make them anyway. I actually know what we're gonna have tonight. I'm gonna cook Jordan and I something. So I'm thinking, because I did bolognese yesterday, I'm going to cook the crispy Cajun fried chicken. You guys can also use my code. That gives you 60% off your first box and then 25% off your next eight boxes. I have my code on the screen here and a link in the description box below. <laughs> I mean, I'm not gonna lie, I completely messed up the breadcrumbs. So, you know, we've improvised, but it still looks really good. It's gonna taste so good. Oh my gosh, last night, Jordan and I had the scare of our lives. The, <laughs> oh my God, we were lying in bed, we were like asleep, and at 11.30, the buzzer started going, and it's like a buzzer from a scary film honestly and i was so scared i was like who the hell is that they wouldn't stop buzzing anyway after like the, obviously we weren't going to open it so i was like i'm not going to open it to some random person after like 30 minutes no that's such an exaggeration after like 15 minutes they post something through the letterbox ran downstairs and it was the police <laughs> but they basically the girl who lived here before me um her car had been stolen uh, her car had been broken into and so they wanted to obviously get hold of her but oh, absolutely scared the living di daylights the living daylights out of me my gosh i am just about to go to a lovely little lunch event for Forever New. They are a really cute brand that I've worked with a few times before. And they're actually opening a store, I believe, in Westfield. So we're doing like a little lunch to celebrate that. I'm wearing one of their lovely little summer dresses, uh, which is actually really cute. I don't often go for colors, floral stuff, as you guys know, but I'm feeling it this year. And then I've just paired it with some little white cowgirl boots. yesterday was so cute it was so nice to go and just have a nice lunch and meet some lovely other like influencer people i actually also met the owner of the brand which was pretty cool she was so nice and today i have a really really exciting meeting i've got a shoot at the flat now um with my photographer who's just going to come around and help me do a few things and then i'm off for a really exciting meeting with my business partner lauren for bikini bible i can't really say too much because i don't know if it's definitely going to go ahead but if it does oh my god it would be amazing if not well they're lost <laughs> so busy busy day rushing around and yeah I love being busy though. I thrive from it. I have just got back from my meeting, which went so well, but I just pray to God that what we just went and did pays off. And yeah, I can't really say too much because I don't want to jinx it, but yeah. Oh my gosh, I've had one of those weeks. It's Thursday now. 5 30 i've still got so much stuff i need to do i'm gonna be it's gonna be a late one tonight but 
oh, I've just got so much motivation and drive and I'm just like, yes, let's just, I've just, I feel like, I don't know. Oops. Anyway, I don't even know where I'm going with this. I'm like also so tired and delirious because I've been up at 6 from 6 a.m. every day. So I also don't really know what's going on. But tomorrow I've got a bit more of a chill day is Friday. So I tend to not do as much on a Friday. Well, saying that. I'm going for lunch with Ruby and Sophie, which will be really nice um, in Mayfair. So I'm excited for that. And yeah, I'm going to sit, finish off. I've actually got to edit a few YouTube videos. I'm going to sit and do that today, um, this evening. And then I'm just going to slump in front of the TV and watch something in my pyjamas. Jordan's gone to boxing, but he'll be back in a bit. And um, yeah, I'm just chill. I feel like, you know when you're tired, when you close your eyes and your eyelids sting? I've got that. Plus my contact lenses are playing up a bit, but... Positive day, positive vibes, and I'm sending them all to you guys. I'm sending positive vibes to you. I just want to say how much I love you guys. I love YouTube as a platform. I've said it a few times before, and I'm just I'm gonna keep saying it. It's just the nicest platform. Like I feel like everyone on here, 90% of people are just so lovely. All the comments are incredible. Just you know, I'm getting so many new subscribers which is so exciting considering i just did this as a bit of a laugh like remember years ago i was a bit like oh should i do this like i was really toying with the idea um i feel like i toy with every idea i always like really think about it for so long and then it takes me ages to do it but you guys have actually given me all the confidence to do it because on my instagram you used to be like yeah do a youtube do it and from you guys i actually do listen and it gives me a bit more confidence. I know that sounds really weird, but it does. Same goes for doing the whole main Chelsea thing. When I was gonna not do last series, it was you guys who made me do it again because you all told me to. I think it's like, I don't know. It's weird because I don't actually personally know any of you, <laughs> but I feel like I do. And you guys probably feel like you know me. So I don't know, it's such a weird thing, isn't it? YouTube and Instagram. I'm grateful I've got this lovely, lovely platform and I think this will be like my fourth video this week, which is too much, but I'm just banging them out there. Okay, I can't even speak at this point because I'm just emotionally drained. I love you all and I'll catch you tomorrow.
it's been a whole lot of training hello everyone it is saturday morning i hope you enjoyed my little montage of me doing my saturday morning jobs because as you guys know this week has been mentally busy for me and i've completely not had any time to kind of do all the little tasks that get forgotten about so i've put on some washes i've done the dishwasher i've cleaned the kitchen and i'm feeling good i'm gonna go to the gym in a minute as well what a lovely saturday as well the sun is shining i'm very very happy feeling good because i'm also just not hung over and i really enjoy not being hung over i know i sound like an absolute alcoholic when i say this but i'm kind of over alcohol and i have been for quite a while like i know my last vlog on the monday I like you can even tell I'd been drinking all weekend because I was like so puffy and I and I felt so ill and I'm just like why do I do this to myself <laughs> oh my god I sound like I've got a problem I don't but <clears throat> my problem is is when I drink which isn't often well most weekends um I'll have some wine but it just doesn't take me a lot to be hung over not gonna lie so Anyway, I'm feeling fresh this weekend. I'm feeling good. I am going out for dinner tonight, so probably we'll end up having a glass of wine. I mean, why not? Fuck it. And uh, yeah, anyway, I have also just had some of my weekly shopping, which I decided to buy myself some things. I decided to treat myself this week. And uh, yeah, I've been hammering the online shopping, so I thought I would just show you what I got because I got some nice home bits as well, so I thought we could open them together because why not? Why not? We can both see what damage I've done. To be honest, it wasn't anything too too pricey. I just got some bits from ASOS and H&M. So, but my friends, bless, how nice are these um, bowls that our friends got us for our home? How cute are they? They're from Soho Home and they're just so nice. I love the colour, this little detail around the edge and I just think when you host, things like this come in handy, especially like these big plates. So I thought that was so sweet that they got these for us. We've honestly had so many lovely moving in gifts, it's crazy. Now it means I need to return the favour to everyone um, when they move home. So I thought we could start off with my H&M parcel, my, my scissors here, ready to destroy the box. I bought some random stuff, not gonna lie. Uh, I didn't go too wild, but what is it that I've got? So I've got some napkins, because they are just paper napkins, but they, like, but you know when you're having dinner, uh, and I've got such, like, a nice dinner set up now, like my placemats, my plates and everything, but I need some nice napkins to go with it. You can't just have kitchen roll on the table, it just ruins the vibe. But I've already bought what I'm about to open, but they come in handy, and I can just put them anywhere around the house, and they look really good. So, guys, if you haven't already got some of these, I did link them in my Instagram, you need to get yourself a terracotta plate. I put my jewellery in there. So I got another one for, I got one of these in my bedroom, but I'm, I'm kind of, I'm going to place them around the house, just because they're really nice, aesthetically pleasing, little, like, handy bowls that you can put anything in. And I found that they did a bigger one online as well. So I was thinking, we kind of don't have anywhere where we put our keys and like our things when we when we kind of come and we just chuck them on the island and i'm thinking they would look so much better in one of those kind of terracotta bowls so i got a bigger one and we can just kind of chuck keys and wallets and whatever it may be i'm going to put that on the island there so anyone can put their bits in there oh my god how cute is a mum and a baby i love it I mean, these again, they're really, really well priced. I think this was like $3.99 and this is about eight, maybe 12, I'm not sure, but you can use them for anything. And they are just aesthetically very, very pleasing. My neighbors are gonna hate me because I've just got boxes full of. And then I finally got a new wash bag because my wash bag, laundry bin, should I call it, just, it's just not a vibe. So I got a new one. And this was the nicest one I found actually. I've been looking for a while and this was just kind of like the easiest, nicest one. Um, and also bigger than the one I currently have because I, I need one for my room upstairs. So this one can go in our room and then the small one can go in there. But it's got these like little tassels on it, which I thought were quite cute. It's pretty plain, but as far as laundry bins go, I thought that would be perfect. Again, it was, it was cheap as well, so. Now for some things I got from ASOS. 
Um, like I said earlier in this vlog, I definitely got influenced by Sophie Boo, and I did tell her this yesterday when I went for lunch with her, uh, about the cowboy boot situation on her hen. So, I bought myself two pairs of cow cowgirl boots, should we call them. These kind of shorter pair, which kind of go with anything, uh, which are actually really nice. I quite like these. I got these just from ASOS. Uh, I can't remember how much they are, but I can link them below for you. But yeah, these ones. And then I found these. And I mean, they are very glitz and glam, but I'm obsessed. I mean, can we just take a moment? How cool are these? Think of these on a night out. I just, these, they're like glittery diamond encrusted cowboy boots. Not me, very unlike me, but I just love them. I think they're so cool. They're my weekly purchases. Uh, I haven't actually bought anything else, thank God. Oh, I have, but it's not arrived yet. I also got myself a cowboy hat from Lack of Colours. Oh my God, it cost me over a hundred pounds and I've ordered it from Australia to then, for then someone to tell me that I'm gonna have to pay like 60 pounds on top of the 140 pounds I bought a straw hat for. A straw hat. But anyway, it will be worth it because it's stunning. It is a lovely hat. Melissa had one when we were in Bali and I wore it all the time. So I was like, I know I'm going to wear it. And I know it's going to look nice. So I bought it. So there we go. Weekly purchases complete. I'm going to head off to the gym now. I'm going to do a steam, a sauna, and a splash of cold water in my shower. I'm going to have a freezing cold shower after. And I'm literally going to feel alive. I highly recommend doing that if you haven't done that before because it is ridiculously nice. A good Saturday morning, guys. I'm, I'm feeling great. protein shake now i'm gonna go and get i've got some friends coming over this evening family friends so i'm gonna go get some nibbles and from bailey and sage and go get my nails done so successful day so far i am back from the nail shop and i got like a nice white color it's like an off-white i don't really know why i went for that it was it's a sunny day today so i was thinking bright colors and i'm like I'm quite pleased with it. I'm not gonna lie. I'm, I don't hate it. I just went to Bailey and Sage. We do the best olives in there. Some nice guacamole, some manchego cheese, and I'm just gonna make a really nice board, which I actually think I'm gonna put on my new plate. What about, what is the time now? Three o'clock. My God, I have done a lot in one day. Whew. I'm going to pack away the shopping, unload the dishwasher, and actually, do a bit more do a bit of work it is a saturday but i am going to sit at my laptop for two and three two to three hours just to get some stuff done because so i'd rather do it today than do it tomorrow and yeah and then i'm going to enjoy my saturday evening so i'm going to clock off here and say goodbye thank you so much for watching guys please like comment and subscribe and also do put below any ideas for any more things that you want to see if there's a certain haul you want to see from maybe zara mango haul whatever it might be please comment below just because you know how much i love your guys kind of input on what you like seeing if whether it be hauls vlogs q and a's let me know and um yeah i mean i have this will be my fourth video out in one week i i have gone mad i'm losing my head I'm on a goddamn YouTube mission right now, but hopefully I can keep up the moment momentum. I mean, next week there won't be as many videos, but I have got one planned. So yeah, lots of love. Can't wait to see you all in the next video.